Good morning. It is a sunny day. <laughs> My next read for the Hugo Awards will be Translation State by Anne Leckie. I have a playlist with all the installments of this series of reading for the Hugo Awards, and I will link it down in the description box as well as up in a card somewhere on the top of the screen. Before the part of chemical analysis of safety items of this air circuit, please pay close attention. I have finished Translation State by Anne Lecky. This science fiction book is set in the same universe as the ancillary justice books. That's a trilogy. I have read the first book in the trilogy, but for some odd reason I never got around to read the other two. I don't really know why, because I really, really enjoyed the first one, so I was quite excited to see this pop up on the Hugo finalist list, because I I had a hunch that I would enjoy it. And I really, really did, as well as the Answer Justice book. And that's a trilogy that I absolutely need to finish, but I have so many other books to read first. So in this book, we actually have several points of view and it tells a story uh, from different points of view and we deal with gender and gender identity, there's like racism, so all kinds of different stuff and it's super like interesting and so well written. I just think Anne Leckie is a 
brilliant, brilliant writer. I can't say I have read a lot by the author, which I have no idea why I haven't, because what I've read I have really, really liked. So I guess I need to read other books as well by the author. Uh, I don't really have a lot of words for this book, uh, other than that I really... I repeat myself. I should stop repeat myself. But I did really like it. And... There are a few characters in the books that I just like... Really, really... I didn't... I can't say that I, I didn't... I didn't fall in love with them, but I really cared for them a lot. And that's an important thing. Uh, if you can like get you to care for many characters and yes I highly recommend this I also want to say that even though this is set in the same universe as the Young Sterling Justice books you don't have to read them first uh, of course it's like a health and it's a, like you can take pick up on things if you've read at least one of them before uh, but it's been a long time since I read Angstrilleri Justice and I can't say that I remember all the details. I remember a lot of like the concept things, but I must say that I didn't feel like I had to read any of that before actually reading this. So that's a plus, of course. And I guess that is it for this time, for this Hugo Wars. I have another... I have a few books left to read, to be honest with you, and I think my next Hugo book will be um, uh, Starter Villain by John Scalzi, but I'm not 100% sure, I need to figure that out. Currently I'm reading something else because I needed a little bit of a break in all the Hugo reading, so I have an arc that I'm currently reading and I'm making a reading vlog for that book as well, so that will come up at some point. I don't know when, but at some point. So I guess that's it for now, and I will see you in the next video. Please remember to give it a like, this video, and subscribe. Hit that notification bell so you don't miss out on anything. And also, if you manage to get this far into this video, leave a rocket emoji and with that i will see you in my next video bye